Well, Nigeria's Minister of Foreign Affairs, Geoffrey Onyama, and the President of the 73rd Session of the United Nations General Assembly, Maria Garces, are holding bilateral talks in Abuja, Nigeria's capital city. The diplomat discussed issues related to the shrinking of the Lake Chad and regional peace, among others. Garces, who is on her second visit to Africa and first to Nigeria, pledged the support of to address the perennial issues. Induced uh, shrinkage of uh, Lake Chad, and um, you know, for us, it's an existential issue uh, because this is a, a, a lake that um, almost 30 million people depend on for their livelihood, and um, we have seen it shrink by almost 90 percent uh, over the years, and um, this has uh, created uh, very severe challenges. Uh, for the people uh, of that sub-region and indeed for, um, uh, for our country. And uh, we are looking to um, have the support of the United Nations and your support uh, in particular uh, to uh, address this challenge. And one of the mechanisms uh, or strategies uh, we have identified is the recharging of the lake. Uh, this is going to be a very capital intensive uh, uh, effort and um, something in the order of um, 40 to 50 billion uh, US dollars uh, estimated. And uh, clearly we're going to um, have to leverage uh, on the international community uh, because these are huge resources. In this very region, uh, the impact manifested in the decline of the Lake Chad uh, Basin and its cascading effects on the environment, on the insecurity and violence displacement uh, and refugees uh, are all interlinked. I visited uh, Chad uh, before arriving here precisely to draw attention uh, to the importance of concrete implementation of the global commitments by development partners. Um, and this support uh, the efforts of Nigeria and its Lake Ch Chad neighbors uh, to address uh, the impacts uh, of the lake and the terrorist activities of Boko Haram. When I was uh, in Chad, I, made, uh, I met with a small number of the over 230,000 Nigerian refugees uh, in Chad. Uh, and I understand that over 2.2 million Nigerians have also been internally uh, displaced uh, by the insur insur insurgency.